This has got the fix-it guy with a common problem with Bosch dishwashers that they have a E24, E25 error which indicates it's having trouble draining. So here's the first thing to try. We take out the filters and we're going to ladle out all the water that didn't drain. And then at a certain point, I usually use a, like a turkey baster to get that water that's in the sump that I can't really get out with a, with a ladle. You just want to get out most of the water. And you want to see if this little drain cap has gotten loose. It's kind of a funny looking thing. But if it's loose, then the machine won't be able to drain. So you want to make sure that it's pushed sol solidly against the edge of the sump and that it's clicked into place. So take your time, play around with it, and try to get it to where it clicks in. If it is clicked in and it still doesn't drain, the next thing it could be is this thing up near the kitchen faucet called the air gap. This particular dishwasher, when I took it off, I found a lot of debris and that was the reason that it wasn't draining. The little drain lid was clicked into place, so this was the suspect. When I took off the cap, I pulled out this big chunk of stuff and it looked like probably what it was at one point was a fish bone that had gotten caught as it tried to drain and a bunch of stuff had collected around it and just clogged the dishwasher's ability to get rid of the water which caused the E24 or E25 drain. So I cleaned all that out, just lifted it out and then I just put the cap back on and then when I tested the dishwasher it was able to drain really well. So it's just a common problem with dishwashers that have these air gaps installed, which is probably about 80% of them. So I'm just putting the filter back in. I gotta make sure I lock it into place so it won't move. And then I'm gonna make the machine go to drain by pressing the start button for three to five seconds. So usually go about five seconds. And then the display will say zero, zero, zero. And when you close it, it should drain. You should be able to hear it going through the air gap, the thing located near the kitchen faucet. So if you ever have a Bosch that doesn't drain or it needs to be reset, you just press that start button for about five seconds and it'll reset. And now I can hear it drain. I did the trick. Hope that's been helpful to you and please subscribe when you get a chance.